Uh, this is the one that we've been talking about. Yeah. Um, do we have any prices on those? There were two prices. There was one where it was a complete system. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let me tell you what the phone message service is. We do not have an effective way of reaching all our citizens if there's an emergency or there's an event. So from a public safety standpoint, it puts us at a disadvantage if there is something that happens that the county is not aware of, that our police department comes upon, say a train derailment, okay, chemicals spilling out, county doesn't know about it, but our police department does. Come to City Hall, put the message on the machine, it calls everybody who's on the list, get out of the city, or don't leave your home, whatever. That's, that's the worst case scenario. The best case is, come to our tree line. Okay, it's an effective way of reaching the citizens, whether you have this or a home line, that's up to you. You know, we'll have a sign-up list. Um, how much are the systems? Okay, I don't remember, I don't have that. Somewhere around 17. Was it about 17? It was less than our system is bought and paid for. There's no service. It's just our system, and you know we can put messages on the water bills. But really, everybody's just looking, frowning at the water bill, not reading the message. So I, I just think it's a really good idea. Council, can we come up with that money before the first? We have it right now. We would come out of Splash Seven. Make a motion that we uh, in, install this message system. For the, for the betterment of the state. Up to the a cost of uh, 2000 Up to the cost of 2000 And we have a motion <coughs> to bring in a phone message service for the uh, city with a cost up to $2,000. <coughs> and we have a second. Okay, discussion. Something we've been needing, something we need is keep our citizens better informed and it's going to be cheaper than a uh, neon billboard. That's right. All in favor? 